Good morning. Welcome back to the theater. It is Friday. I am awake, but barely, but we are here. Um, I don't know if I'm going to see anybody else today other than one staff member, the person who's coming in to do ticket center stuff. Our ticket center slash box office is still open despite the fact that we have no shows. So it gets very boring for whoever's working there. So there's a lot of them just struggling to find other things to do. So anyways, I am really tired today. And I think that this weekend I need to try to like shift back my sleep schedule a bit because I was up probably till like 1.30 or two o'clock last night through all faults of my own is just me deciding not to go to sleep my bad so i <sighs> need to resolve that today might need to take a nap today we will see how timing is because i'll probably be off around like one ish and dnd starts at like 5 30 and i have yesterday's vlog to edit and eight million other things that i probably should be doing so we will see what happens but for now i think i'm going to go have a breakfast drink and get ready to get to work. Uh, there were a lot of people in the theater yesterday, but like I said, I have no idea if I'm gonna see anybody today other than one person. It's so weird. I'm always the first one in, so it used to be that I would get in and I'd be like, oh, it's 8.38, that's when the next person comes in, and then it's 8.43, that's when the next person shows up. Like, I knew everybody's schedule, but now it's like, <laughs> I got bored and I left work. <laughs> It's um, just quarter after 12. I decided to just work a four hour shift today because I got bored. I mean, I was, I did some painting and I did like some cleaning in various different areas. And then I went through and I made a list of maintenance -y things that need to be fixed or done or whatever. And I was like, I cannot do this anymore. I think it, the main thing I painted today was just some stools. <laughs> Very exciting. And, um, I think they probably need uh, one more coat on the top, but I'll do that on Tuesday because I'm on my three day weekend because I just set my own schedule. So three days off. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so I have an extra hour, which is very exciting. I've changed into my workout gear. I'm still rocking the sweatpants because walking by the ocean, it gets a little breezy. <laughs> Yesterday I was like, hey Google, is it windy? And she's like, no, it's not windy. It's only 20k. I'm like, that seems kind of windy, but she's saying it's not. It was. It was definitely windy. So I don't know what her threshold for windy is. If it's like 70k, I don't know. Anyways, so it does get a little chilly walking by the ocean. So I still have my like capri sweatpants. I have not upgraded to shorts or whatever yet, and it works. And then this works, but it was windy yesterday, and I really should have had a jacket. But that's fine. Uh, I'm just trying to decide if I want to go for a walk now or eat and then go for a walk in a bit because because I'm not sure if I'm hungry enough right now but also I don't know if I'll be not hungry enough to go does that make sense I don't know if I'm gonna get like halfway and then be like oh I should have had lunch so that's what I'm trying to decide right now it is D&D &D today so having this extra hour is nice and um, it's supposed to rain like all weekend, so that's another reason why I'm, I want to get this walk in today. So it's going to happen, I just don't know when. I'm thinking I'm leaning towards food. I should probably just eat now. I can't remember if there's left. Oh, there's leftover. We had hot dogs last night. I could have hot I don't want hot dogs right now. Okay, we have to figure out what to make. So I'm going to go make myself some food, and then I'll probably do a little bit of work, maybe do some writing or something, or set up some more embroidery because I only have Notre Dame left that is a project on the go. I've got ideas of what I want to set up so I'm gonna do that but first food. Alrighty so I fed myself and then as is typical on days when I work I forgot I had to edit the vlog so it is rendering right now. Hopefully I can get through it pretty quickly because it's like 20 after 1. My intention is to be walking by 2 o'clock but we will see if that happens. Also, in exciting news, an order I placed the other day is on the way. It's out for delivery. It is another one of... Oh, wait, I'm going to drop everything if I lift this up now. It's another one of these for my embroidery floss and everything. And some more three-inch hoops. I hope that these are good hoops because um, the five-inch hoops that I got the most recent time, a couple of them are 
misshapen a little bit. I think I mentioned it yesterday. Um, and this is from the same company, so hopefully they're okay. Um, especially because last night I ordered another two sets of them. I couldn't order from the one that I originally ordered from because they just weren't available and they didn't know if they'd be back in stock. So I'm assuming they're very similar, if not the same, I don't know. And then I also finally found some five inch hoops and six inch hoops that were available for purchase. So I ordered two packs of five inch and a pack of six inch, but their delivery date is very long. So it's going to be like mid July to August, somewhere in there. So if I need them, hopefully by that point, if I need them, my mom can just send them out to me when somebody comes into town. So that's exciting. But yeah, that's where we're at. That's the update. I'm, oh, I always forget that I got to edit this vlog. That was the one nice thing either about staying up late and editing it that night, which maybe I should get back into, or getting up at six in the morning because I would have it edited and upload it before 8 a.m., which was great. I don't know, should I start getting up early again? I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> I'm just gonna work on that. I've been working on a list of embroidery projects that I wanna start, because I wanna get those all traced and ready for D&D tonight. Obviously I won't get through all of them. It takes like even something small like the D20 that I did yesterday. Like even something small like this, it still takes a couple hours to do. It's so cute, I love it. <laughs> but yeah, so we will see, but I wouldn't mind having just a couple ready to go because every time I'm like finishing a project, I'm like, what should I do next? Because I just do whatever I want. <laughs> whenever I want and it leads to some really cool things and then other things I'm like I hate this <laughs> a lot of things that I hate anyways I'm gonna stop rambling I'm gonna get into this and like it looks like it'll be like another two minutes and then again hopefully I can get out walking by two-ish and hopefully the weather holds and I am back <laughs> I went for a walk you might be able to tell from my flushed face and um, also you might see that I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt because it was actually pretty cloudy and getting kind of blah. It's supposed to rain over the weekend, again, which is why I wanted to get out today. So I, the clouds are coming in, so that's, that's fine. I definitely enjoy walking in the sun better than walking in the not sun, <laughs> but it's fine. I got out there, I did. How, how far did I go? 5.56k, which I think is the most I have done since I started walking. It was because there's crosswalks that I can like hit the button for and cross, but I usually just try to wait until there's no traffic, but it is the highway and it's also like, it's only 325, so I don't understand why there was so much traffic, but it is what it is. So I just, I end up going, I was like, okay, fine, I'll go to the next crosswalk. And then like just before I got to it, I was able to get across. Uh, anyways, so I am back now. I have that list that I want to start tracing things out of. And I thought something, I thought of something on my, I remember it. While I was walking, I thought of something else that I could um, prep. And I remembered, so that's good. Assuming I prep them all, I've got seven different things that I can get ready to go. We'll see if it happens. And when I got home, my Amazon package had arrived, so I've got more three inch hoops <laughs> and another one of these guys to hold my embroidery floss because I have a shipment of like 50 coming from a store somewhere in Canada. It's in Ontario somewhere uh, I, where I selected the colors. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this the other day. And then I also ordered a pack of 150 just assorted colors. So I just don't want to run out of like a specific color or don't want to be like, wow, I could really use a chartreuse and I don't have a chartreuse. I, I don't think I would ever have that thought because I always forget that chartreuse is like a green. I always like chartreuse just seems like a purple to me in my head. That's what I associate it with. Anyways, <laughs> I think what I'm going to do is I see that um, somebody posted a YouTube video that I usually watch her vlog. So I'm going to watch that cool down for a bit, drink this water, and then I think like I might shower. I'm not sure. My intention was to shower, but I didn't sweat as much as I could have because it wasn't it. So I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. I'm definitely gonna have to change here though. So I'm gonna drink water, watch this vlog, rip this sticker off because those are annoying. And um, then I'll change and kind of get started on the list of transferring patterns slash drawing patterns slash hoping for the best.
Well, hello. It has been many hours. I just changed my pajamas because bras are the worst. It is currently about 10 30. We finished DD, I would say like half an hour ago, give or take. Um, it was a pretty good session. Uh, me and this one other guy made up this massive panicked lie at one point, calling somebody else a traitor, and it really worked out well for us. And um, nobody in our party died, which was a good possibility. So that's exciting. I also finished this piece. I started and finished it during the D&D session, so that's cute. It's the same as the other uh, D20 I did the other day, just different colors. I can envision myself making a lot of these because they are quick and they are cute. Um, that one's I really like the colors of that one, but they're not exact, like, I prefer the pastel -y ones. Uh, so I'm gonna clean up now because everything is a mess, like, it's, it's bad. So I have my little TV tray up here, which have my laptop on it, and which you are currently sitting on, and then I have all my D&D &D stuff below, and um, it's gonna go back in this bag again for now until I figure out a new solution so that's exciting and then I guess I'll clean up <laughs> that it's and the floor is bad too I still haven't done laundry I was supposed to do it like four days ago and I haven't done it yet and it's just getting worse and worse to be honest uh, tomorrow hopefully but now I don't work until Tuesday, and so technically I could probably make it through until Tuesday. I guess Monday without doing it, so we'll see. Anyways, that's clean, so that's nice. I just like, I don't need to be like a really tidy person, but my workspace needs to not be a disaster and it kind of has been lately because I'm just I'm doing so much stuff in the same space and it's been a little bit annoying but that's fine I can't wait until I get my other flosses in and I can rearrange all my my beautiful guys into different colors okay I think we're mostly organized so I finished I started and finished this guy but I did draw this guy. I got a little cute little whale. <laughs> so cute. Uh, a lighthouse. And then because I love memes and puns, this is fine. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'll get on those probably tomorrow. Maybe at some point I will finish Notre Dame. I have to redraw the detailing in because I didn't want to do the detailing the way it was done. So that's where we're at. But yeah, I'm feeling good that I made a fair amount of progress on these things, and I've got a couple extras ready to go. I just, I, there's so much stuff going on. And then, yeah, maybe I should deal with that over there, maybe, perhaps. Definitely before I go to bed, but I can sleep in tomorrow, which is nice because your girl's tired, <laughs> and, um, I would appreciate the sleeping in and I'm gonna check the weather for tomorrow to see you know what it looks like it's gonna be nice in the morning so theoretically as long as I don't wait too long I can go for a walk tomorrow so that's cool anyways that's just the update on the afternoon oh I didn't put my scissors away I thought I had lost a needle while we were playing D&D &D, and I was like this is the worst because I lost a needle relatively recently I'd say it was probably like a week or so ago now and I have no idea where it is and so every once in a while when I'm walking through here I'm like it's gonna stab me but so far so good anyways I'm gonna go now tidy up and then figure out whatever I'm doing next well it's midnight and I have found most of my bed and most of my floor so I think that means it is time for me to go to sleep um tomorrow I get to sleep in which is very exciting and then I wrote a giant list of things that I want to do tomorrow <laughs> the, the most important thing on the list I think is laundry I know I know I really need to do laundry. I can barely get my hamper under my bed. But that's where we're at. So with that, I'm going to say goodnight. And I'll maybe see you tomorrow, depending. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs>